This appears to be a very violent crash. Happened about 9 o'clock this evening, and investigators are still on the scene. They're actually adding more barricades right now, which makes me think that this investigation is going to last a little while longer. Take a look at just the front end of this Mustang here. You can see it uh, had an enormous amount of impact, a lot of force to do that much damage to the front of the car. Take a look at this video that we got as we arrived on the scene. One of the three people that were injured in the other vehicle being rushed to the hospital. I'm told that the adult driver of that car is in critical condition. There are also two children in that car that received minor injuries, but all three had to be rushed to the hospital. Now, the driver of the Mustang was not injured. Uh, members of the Riverside County Sheriff's Department have given him a breathalyzer test and also done other field sobriety tests, and it doesn't appear that he's failed any one of those. Usually what happens if they end up blowing a bad number on that breathalyzer test is they'll put him in handcuffs immediately. They have not done that. He does appear to be cooperating with the Sheriff's Department at this point, so it doesn't appear that alcohol appears to be a factor in this crash as of just yet but as you can see here at the scene the street is shut down and as I mentioned they are still adding quite a few barricades here so I can guess that this road's going to be shut down for at least a couple hours more so if you happen to be in the East Valley keep in mind that the northbound lanes of Harrison just by uh, past Avenue uh, 52 will most likely remain closed. Reporting live in Coachella Joe Galley CBS Local 2. All right Joe thank you you have been very busy tonight.